An important aspect of UAV applications is being able to assess the risk of a flight. A large component of this risk is being able to estimate the energy consumption of the UAV as running out of battery can lead to a potentially dangerous situation. In this work, we present a deep learning-based energy model that achieves state-of-the-art results for total energy and power consumption estimation. We additionally present a stochastic simulation framework that uses Monte Carlo runs to provide a distribution on the energy usage to then find the conditional value at risk in the risk space. These contributions combined create a risk assessment method to help determine flight risk levels leading to safer operations. We use a publicly available real-world temporal dataset to train the deep learning model. The dataset records multiple data points with measurements that give power consumption, angle of attack, wind angle, wind speed, and inertial velocity. The data is collected at different altitudes, payload sizes, and commanded speeds. We use temporal convolutional networks to capture the time-varying features, such as air velocity, while incorporating the contextual information, such as payload weight and air density. In contrast with previous methods, our model does not require segmenting flights into different regimes. We tested our model on a set of unique test flights and found that we improved the power estimations by 29% and the energy estimations by 31%. The mean average percentage error was around 10% for estimated power consumption and 7% for total flight energy consumption. In order to estimate the risk for a flight, Monte Carlo simulations are performed for the mission parameters and environmental conditions, including the wind field. We then compute the energy consumption distribution for the set of simulated flights. We scale the distribution using a risk profile and compute the conditional value at risk. This gives a metric for the riskiness of this particular flight. This method can also be used for evaluating coverage area from a takeoff location. As the UAV travels out from the takeoff location, the risk of the flight increases. This proposed framework helps calculate a more informative metric to better assess the flight risk for a UAV.